We're back, and this is Jamie, who you met earlier, and this is Ilya, who's enjoying the beautiful sounds moving through her body. So this is wonderful to start a healing session or to do a sound session. This is the Indian tree that we spoke of earlier that has the sound portals on the side, so twice as much sound is going through the body. So if you've got any questions, just ask me. So the healing sound, as well as the vibration, what is that doing for the body? It's creating coherency throughout every cell. And if you looked at a person's aura, which I have pictures of, and I may include in this uh, video later, um, we did aura pictures. And you can see the color of the aura changing dramatically. This particular tuning works a lot with transmuting whatever's issue, whatever issues are in the body, and that are causing emotional and physical stress and the reason why I start at the bottom strings and I'm I'm not picking particularly is the soft soothing strumming motion creates the greatest coherency for the body and if you do this five or seven minutes it has a phenomenal effect. And now we're going to ask Ilya if she would like. We're going to ask her to turn over. And we will play. We've now turned Ilya over. Actually, she turned herself. Yes. And did you notice that? She did it early. Yeah, yeah, she, she did, did a good job, too. And so, you know, what's this? What we've done is a lot of times people have pains in their back or they could be having pains in their legs and wherever the pain is we put the heart dramatic uh, directly over that part of the body and the outcome is you will hear people tell you that that pain is now gone so it's a vibrational healing or exactly what was creating the pain and moving the energy through the block Exactly. Uh, and, you know, at the same time, it's giving the whole rest of the body such a sense of relaxation. On the other side of the body, and probably the side too, it's stimulating the immune system and increasing the number of white blood cells the body's making. And so anything that you do in terms of playing this harp, it's all going to feel good and sound good to your body. The longer strokes are better for the healing, but then when you want to just play it and have fun, you can do whatever you yeah. want. So there's nothing you can do wrong. Yeah, that's the best part. It's like you can be a child or you can be a child at heart. And that's the best part is being a child, a child at, at heart. heart. Well, that's good Child too. Heart. I like that too. I think that. Yeah. It'll put a smile on your face faster than anything I've ever seen. Yeah. <laughs> well, now we're going to the angelic tuning, and Ilya gets to stay and have fun, and so do we. How's that working for you, Ilya? Mm. Ah. <laughs> we hear sighs and moans of approval. <laughs> this is one of my favorite hearts, Janie. Also because this heart, I normally play two of them and I play for weddings. Oh. But you can just hear the angelic frequencies. And what this does is it works with the upper chakras. And so we've now balanced the lower chakras so then the person is ready to move into those places of heart and spirit and to feel relaxed, and more open to the expression of spirit in their life and the, the appearance of angels too. Mm -hmm. So, don't 
don't be surprised what happens when you start playing these beautiful harps. And they're wonderful to sing with. And if you don't sing, you may find yourself singing. So don't be surprised. And now we're going to shift. I wouldn't normally move that fast, but we're going to shift to the uh, dragonfly. So you get a chance okay. to see that one too. Okay. There we go. You still okay? Kit, go ahead. You still happy down there? Mm. Mm. Okay, so this is the dragonfly. Yeah, I think I'll hold it up so you can see it. Because this has the sound portals. Mm -hmm. And it also has this beautiful dragonfly sitting in the center oh. of it. Isn't that beautiful? So what's the difference between the dragonfly and the other one the, that had the, the tree? tree? Well, the tree is in the Indian tuning, and it's in a minor key. And this is in an angelic key, excuse me, a major key and an angelic key. Wow. And it's also more connected with the notes of the upper chakras. Okay, that's right, because I don't feel the same thing. No. the heart and the throat as I did with the other one. So this is all higher. Mm -hmm. So she's breathing in that vibration and that sound through her back exactly. right now. Wow. Exactly. And that energy is moving through her body. Wow. What, does she levitate? I would think I'd be doing that if I were her. But you know, just standing here, doing this, we're getting a healing too. Yeah. So it's nothing but a wonderful experience for everybody involved. And there you have it. Do you have any more questions? I'm not in my body to speak right now. <laughs> <laughs> I have that problem at yeah. times too. Well, we're going to show you someone who just experienced the heart yesterday uh, and fell in love with it. He plays it in ways I've never played it, so we're going to oh. share with you Zach playing the Indian tree. Oh, how wonderful. Oh, yeah. Well, Ilya, I think you're going to enjoy yourself for a while. See you again soon.